hi everyone so in this video we will be making a pop-up which you can trigger when you click on any item in your menu on your website header we will be making a clean pop-up like this and if you want you can follow along the tutorial step by step we will be using elementor pro for creating this pop-up and your users can easily log into your website when they click on login they will be shown a login widget so let's get started okay so first of all you need to go to your wordpress dashboard and create a menu go to appearance menus so after you come to menu select the main menu where you want to add the login widget after you have selected the menu we need to go to screen options and select css classes make sure it's checked it because it is very important for this tutorial now we need to go to custom links and for url we need to add the pound sign and in the link text we will add login whatever you add in the link text is the text which will appear on your menu now you see login appears on our menu when you click on it you will be shown further options where you can add css classes so we need to click on css classes and here we need to give it a class of login dash popup you can give any class you want but i'll give it a unique class and i'll use login dash popup and for css class you don't need to add a dot before it after you are done saving the menu next step is to create a popup now to create a popup we need to go to templates just right below elementor and click on popups after you come to popups click add new and give your popup a name for our popup we'll give it a name of login dash popup so we can easily remember it now click create template so these are the templates in elementor by default we will not be using these popups instead we will create our own so once you arrive in your pop-ups go to settings go to style and click background and give it a background color so i'll choose this light purple now we will click the six dots go to the main widget selection area search for login widget and just drag and drop it here after we have dragged the login widget we will go to the login widget settings go to advanced and give it some padding so that the text has some breathing space we have given the widget a padding of 5% now we go to style and adjust the rose gap to 20 now give it a color of white and adjust the label gap and adjust it to 10 and give it a color of white adjust the typography to poppins 18 go to fields and give it a text color of black now you cannot see the text color because we have pre-filled information now you go to border radius and make the border to about 8 pixels so that the border is more rounded now you go to button and give it a border radius of 8 percent 8 pixels so you see the borders are more rounded and soft now we go to pop-up settings advanced and open by selector this is really important now you need to add a dot and login dash popup so it is the same class which we have added to the menu item in our wordpress dashboard it should be the same as the one you have written here so in the wordpress dashboard you did not need to have a dot before it but in elementor you need to tell it that it's a class so we will add a dot before it this is really important to make it work now we will click publish and add condition will make it show on entire site and for triggers we don't need any triggers for advanced rules we don't need to put any advanced rules so now the pop-up is live so to test the pop-up we can go and refresh the page after you refresh the page you see that the menu item has appeared you see this login now when you click on it you will see this clean and simple pop-up appear so your users can easily log in here and it doesn't require your visitors to load a new page so this is how you can trigger a pop-up when you click on an item 
anywhere on your page. You just need to create a CSS class for that object and then in pop-up settings you need to select open pop-up by selector. So if you like the tutorial please consider liking the video and subscribing the channel.